Hong Kong International Airport, among the world's busiest hubs, powers the city's global connectivity while steering towards sustainable aviation. Peter, what's HKIA's game plan to reach net zero emissions? In 2021, AAHK made a landmark commitment to achieve net zero carbon by 2050 for HKIA, a pledge joined by 30 key aviation business partners. To ensure we stay on track, we've established an interim 2035 target. Our comprehensive decarbonization roadmap focuses on three key areas. First, we're accelerating the transition to electric vehicles across airside operations through our Airside Vehicles Electrification Program. Second, we've launched an innovative electric ground services equipment pooling scheme to maximize resource efficiency. And third, we've been systematically installing solar panels on airport facilities to expand renewable energy generation while implementing cutting edge energy efficiency measures throughout our infrastructure. While ground operations are crucial, in-flight emissions remain a key challenge, especially aviation fuel. Airlines are actively phasing out older, less efficient aircraft, but the real game changer is sustainable aviation fuel. This revolutionary fuel alternative offers our most promising path to significant emissions reductions. Unlike conventional jet fuel, SAF is produced from renewable feedstocks like recycled cooking oil, animal fats, and agricultural waste. Through advanced refining processes, it delivers comparable performance while generating up to 80% fewer life cycle greenhouse gas emissions compared to fossil-based alternatives. The environmental benefits are clear, but challenges remain. Currently, SAF costs three to five times more than traditional jet fuel due to limited production scale and supply chain constraints. That's why we're working closely with fuel suppliers, policymakers, and industry partners to develop solutions that will make SAF more accessible and affordable for Hong Kong's aviation sector.